Hey everyone, I'm King. Welcome back to King Spade channel. So we are back again with another ninja video and this time it is about the ninja gold weapon effect. But before that, I received quite a number of comments asking what is the type of armor the ninja use. I understand some of you might want to try the ninja job class once it is available in the SCA server. So the ninja uses the same type of armor as the archer job class. So if you are a dex type user, you don't have to change the armor. If you are of the different class, you may want to get a new set of armor. Alright, so let's look at the gold weapon effect for ninja. As you may already know, the ninja can use two weapons, the ninja sword and the shuriken. Let's start with the shuriken first. The first gold weapon for shuriken, we have the weapon dropped by the MVP mistress, Huma Shuriken Chaos. After the water attribute damage inflict slow effect by 75% last one second and deal 320% water attribute magic damage to the target and its surrounding 4 meters triggered every 5 seconds next gold weapon drop by MVP Maya go with the flow in battle has 50% chance to remove 2 debuff every 2 seconds increase 7% INT and VIT start for every debuff removed last 10 seconds and can stack up to 5 times. I thought the shuriken is more to PvE playstyle but this effect I think is more suitable to be used in PvP. Next gold weapon dropped by MVP Amonra, Summer Bobo. Previously we have water and now we have wind. After dealing with wind attribute damage, deal 639% wind attribute magic damage to the target and its surrounding 3 meters, triggered every 3 seconds seconds. Looks like the wind element deal more frequent damage as compared to the water element and with that deal more total damage as well. Next gold weapon dropped by MVP Morok, Nano Throwing Knife. When weapon refined level reach level 8, for every refined level increase onwards, decrease final haste by 1.25% and increase damage to angel and demon race monster by 15%. This is quite a specific weapon. Next gold weapon dropped by MVP Tau Gunka, Demon Dragon's Eye. When escape technique skill deal damage, final magic damage bonus is increased by 7%, lasts 6 seconds, and stacks up to 20 times. Now this is more suitable to be used for PvE, or in general to be honest this can also be used in PvP. Next gold weapon dropped by MVP Fallen Bishop, Flat Grinder, after dealing with fire attribute damage inflict ignite status to the target only one target will be selected and deal 1598 percent fire attribute magic damage every second plus four seconds hp reduced up to 30 percent maximum hp ineffective against mvp mini and boss triggered every eight seconds if the water is more for inflicting slow effect the wind element deals a more consistent continuous damage and the fire is just pure damage, dealing high damage. And finally, gold weapon drop by MVP Arc Angeling. Galactic Council. After casting skill, inflict dazzle status to surrounding 5 meters targets. HP is decreased by 10%, last 3 seconds, triggered every 9 seconds. Every target inflicted by dazzle effect will increase PvP final magic damage bonus by 1%, last 20 seconds, stacks up to 20 times and restore passive skill cooldown by 2 seconds. Alright, this is specifically to be used for PvP. Next, let's look at the Ninja Sword. The first one, we have Gold Weapon dropped by MVP Kraken. 8 Horn Dragon Cage. Mist Slash Skill reduces the target physical defense by 17% times Trauma Effect Stack Numbers plus 1. Lasts for 8 seconds. If the target has cross Trauma Effect status, all allies have 20% chance to deal 100% ignore defend damage to the target, last 8 seconds. Very specific weapon as well. Only effect the miss slash skill. Next gold weapon dropped by MVP Oak Lord, Sharp Wind Sword. Every time dealing skill damage, have 20% chance to deal 22.5% through damage of the skill damage to surrounding 2 meters at most 3 targets. Next gold weapon dropped by Doppelganger, Vacuum 
film knife this is a long one i make the translated description in paragraph so it is easier to understand the weapon effect when dealing damage with shadow slash skill so again specific weapon that only affect the shadow slash skill if the target is a player additionally deal 0.2 percent target maximum hp neutral attribute through damage if the target is a monster additionally deal 107 percent shadow attribute physical damage if the target has one of these effects bleed darkness immobilize or slow has 50 percent chance to deal additional damage each debuff is judged independently and one shadow slash damage can trigger at most five times additional damage next gold weapon drop by mvp time holder flame knife after dealing damage inflict the target with curse status only one target is selected maximum hp is decreased by 10 percent last 10 seconds stacks up to three times ineffective against mvp mini and boss and deal 1980 percent shadow attribute damage triggered every three seconds when the weapon refined is refined plus four every refine level increase onwards will ignore the target 10 percent curse resistance stat next gold weapon drop by mvp lost dragon mukadas kanjar the name is very specific and this weapon actually exists in ragnarok online and can only be used by ninja as well shadow attribute enhancement is increased by 71 percent after casting skill four times skill damage is increased by 85 percent last four seconds triggered every 12 seconds wow i think this is easily one of the go-to gold weapon for ninja sword because of its simple requirement and has a good effect on top of that next gold weapon dropped by mvp lord of the dead emerald wing in battle gain one stack of resist physical damage effect every two seconds last six seconds and can stacks up to five times every stack consume will randomly trigger the following effect one deal 938 percent neutral attribute damage to the attacker to recover 13% HP and lastly gold weapon drop by MVP Gioia praise and glory awaken king sword the name is a little weird and this is another long one for every 10% maximum HP lost you and one random teammate will execute all of the following triggered every 10 seconds one has 20% chance to gain two stacks of physical damage resist effect two has 20% chance to recover 1.6% maximum hp calculation pvp i think it means the hp recovered is calculated using the pvp damage formula instead of the normal pve against monster calculation three has 20 percent chance to gain final damage increase by 17 percent four has 20 percent chance to gain movement speed increase by 10 percent and five has 20 percent chance to gain physical damage bonus increase by 26 percent all last for five seconds all right that is all of the gold weapon for ninja sword and shuriken weapon if i have to choose for in general use i will go for the gold weapon drop by mvp tau gunka demon dragon's eye for shuriken or the gold weapon drop by mvp lost dragon mukadas kanjar for ninja sword the effect seems to be universal it can be used for pvp as well as pve a safe choice i can say but what are your pick let me know at the comment below that's it for this video this time video shout out goes to thank you for always supporting me and this channel if you like this video give it a thumbs up and hit the subscribe button and also don't forget to turn on the notification bell so you will be notified whenever i upload a new video thanks for watching and i'll see you on the next video and as always happy playing bye bye